Hello, welcome back to another video. <laughs> Today, um, I actually have a grail figure to open. Um, so excited! Yes, but we're gonna go over some merch first. So first, it's not really merch, because the things I got that I like. We have, th this has been accumulated since the last time, the last video I made, so bear with me. We've got this little guy. He's from a, a video game. My, so, a series that I really like, series, a company I should say, I really like, um, released a video game called The Liar Princess and the Blind Prince, and I love that video game. And then I saw another one coming out with the same art style, I was like, oh my god, is it the same company? It is. Anyways, they came out with one called, ooh, it's called this. I think, uh, that's editing, but I think it's called something like The Dragon King... The brave, the brave hero and the dragon king, dragon king, or something like that. Something like that. But um, I got the America release of the game, which comes with the boy. But the Japanese one came with the dragon, and I needed the dragon because oh my god, like how cute he is. So I got him off of Bai using um, Mercari, Japan Mercari, JP Mercari. Um, he was kind of expensive. He was like seventy, no, seven thousand yen, which is like. Easy conversions, $70, but it was probably around like 50, 48. So expensive, yes, but do I love it? Do I think it's worth it for what I emotionally feel? Yes. Next thing, socks. I found these Madoka Magica socks. Sadly, it's only one pair. I thought it was like one of these, one pair of these, one pair of these, but I think these are so stinking cute. I got them for like seven bucks off of Yahoo Japan auctions using Bai once again. Um, anything else from Bai? I don't think so. Alright, our next thing we're gonna cover is cans. Sounds weird, I know. And not like tin can badges. Cans. So, first off, we have this Hatsune Miku can. It's so cute. It was supposed to be cotton candy flavored. It did not taste like cotton candy. Um, I actually hated how it tasted, so I dumped it out and I'm keeping the can. But it tasted more like a creamsicle or something really bad hated it next one we have oh i got that at my local fye um next one we have is a charizard can i have four of these so i'll probably show off the other three after i finish drinking them um but here's a charizard one um this was like a lychee flavored sparkling water i didn't think i'd like it i loved how it tasted i was like Ooh, give me more of that so there's that guy and it opened a really fun way so i'm excited for the other three the next thing we have is the inazuma genshin visions that go along with the other visions i have so if you watched my previous videos i have the leo a visions and i gave ming guang the geo one and i have the uh, monstat visions and i gave i wish i could say i gave mona the water one I don't know who I'm giving the water one to. I don't know if I'm giving it to Barbara, who's I haven't put her away yet, who's right here. Or I don't know if I'm giving it to Mona, who is away on my shelf. But I have given Venti the uh, anima one, even though technically his vision is a fake because he's a god and the gods don't receive visions. Anyways, so I'll show you all of the Inazuma ones. We have, I'm, I'm going to name them all. Oh, also the new banner just got announced of what's going to be for next update. It's going to be Scaramouche and Ido which I don't really care either way about those two, but the four stars, oh my god, there's a new four star girl, I don't know how to pronounce her name, she looks gorgeous, and Goro's coming back, and I'm like, I'm gonna have a better chance to get Goro, I am so excited, because I still don't have him, and I love him, but first off, we have Goro or Ito, whoever you like more, um, Ayaka, nice, Kokomi, I have Kokomi, and for some reason, I can't think of her name when I need to. Yai Miko, Raiden Shogun, Koki Shino Shinobu, whoever you want that one to be. Um, Toma! And... Who is this? Oh my gosh, give me a sec. I'll think of one. I'll think of one. Is Scaramouche in Inazuma Vision? It can't be. He can't be. He is Animo, though. <gasps> Kazuha! 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 Duh! I have Kazuha on my team. I should know this. But yeah, if, if you don't know the names, this one's Animo. Geo. Ooh. Electro. Pyro. 
Ky- Cryo, and Hydro. So there's all those. Next update. So I don't know if you guys watched my first video. If you didn't, that's okay. I'll link it. You can go watch it. You can watch it. You don't have to watch it. YouTube's. But um, in the first video, I unboxed my Ningguang 1 7 I want to say, figure and my Venting Android. And the Venting Android had a broken neck peg. And I emailed Good Smile. They took forever to get back to me. And they ended up resending me a body part because the neck peg is stuck in the body part. But they resent me a body part. So he's all set up and good to go. I'll actually grab him out. Because in that video, I had to take videos of him me holding the head on because how else am I supposed to show you the uh, display options? So give me one second. So there's the boy, the man, the myth, the legend. <sighs> and I think that's all of the, let me close my cabinet open. I think that is it for all of the merch I got. I think so. So into the grail figure. Turn the box the other way. Here's the box that came in. I got this off of Bai Yahoo Japan Auctions because this figure released, I remember correctly, I'll put the page up right here, but the correct info, the, that's the correct information. What I'm thinking right now is it released in 2009 for around 6,000 yen. Um, it is now 2022 and I got them for 30,000 yen. Not happy about it, but you get what you can get. So, here we are. If you've ever seen them or have these guys, you know, you know. But if you don't, I'll open them. <laughs> these are the girls from Holic. Don't call me a fake fan. It's been a hot second since I've watched the show. I can't remember their names. But I am so excited to have them. Oh my gosh. The blue one has always been my favorite because, you know, she has blue hair, blue hair pretty. But I think she also had a different attitude too, and I liked her. But here we are without the bubble wrap on. I do have the Holic Nendroids pre-ordered. So the girl and the guy, I'm so sorry for not being able to remember the names right now. I have them pre-ordered off of Tom and I've heard that Tom takes a hot second. So I'm like, ooh, but they had bonus acrylic, not acrylic, um, bonus like screens. And the guy first off needs the butterflies. Like, like that should be included. So I had to get the bonus screen. And the girl has like smoke effects and she needs that because she's holding her pipe. So those should be included, but they're Tom bonuses. So I had to buy off Tom for the first time. Um, Tom is expensive. So far, I don't like it, but <laughs> we'll see when it comes. But there's a picture. So yeah, these guys retailed for 6,000 yen together. Oh, I never cut all the tape. I'm such an idiot. And I found them off of Yahoo Japan Auctions. Brand new, never opened. I'm hoping they're not sticky. I'm gonna be sad if they're sticky. What the heck is going on? Oh, I'm just not able to open the box because I'm an idiot, apparently, as well. Okay. I would have liked to also show you guys the records I got, but... Okay, so... I have... Where is it? Right here. Yes, I've got another shelf above you. Ooh! I have the black-pink record. It skips because it's warped. Because... They did a really bad job printing these vinyls. And I got another one over the weekend. By the way, it's Monday when I'm filming this. <laughs> I got another one over the weekend, hoping that it wouldn't skip, you know, so I could have a good one that actually works, because I bought the CD, because that one skips, but it's so pretty that I have to keep it. But anyways, that one, the one I bought over the weekend, skips. So I'm gonna be returning that. And then I also got the Melanie Martinez K-12 through vinyl, and that one skips. So I got another one today before coming home, and that one skips. So I'm gonna be returning both of those. I'm so sad. I am so sad. Before my, well, I'm starting this video, though, I was listening to my Bo Burnham Inside record. I think I was listening to the first one on side A. So I was listening to FaceTime with my mom right before this video. So there you go. The inside scoop. But these are like, okay, back to the figures. These are like the only older figures that I think I'll ever get. Cause I think older figures always look derpy. I loved how they looked. Looks so like, oh my God, why didn't these really, re why did these? First, why did they re-release, first off? Second off, why did they release so long ago? I know the show was like more popular back then. I even have, where is he? No, there you are, you're next to Blue. Oh, come on out. Back. I even have a Mokana plush because I love him. He's my favorite. 
Mokuna is best boy. Best boy. Snow Mokuna might be better boy. Not the white one. Snow Mokuna, specifically. <laughs> but yeah. Um, I know there is a scale figure of the other. It's the main girl, the one that has the smoke screen with the Android. I know there's a scale figure for that recently is coming out or is coming out. I want to say it's by Square Enix. I'll put the information up right now. But, um... I don't like how she looks. I think she looks really bad. I love the, the, the sofa that she comes with. I love the, the smoke that she comes with. I like the pipe she comes with. I think she looks bad. <sighs> Anyways, finally got the plastic Ooh, open. Let's not drop them though, because I will freaking cry. So let's start with the base. The base is taped in, all right. Let's start with the girls. We can start with the girls. I'm putting this down here, so I'm not gonna drop them. I want to say they're one eighth scales, which is kind of small. I don't know what scale they are. I want to say they're one eighth. Let's assume they're one eighth until I've been proven otherwise. Here's our first girl. Not sticky, which is nice. Sorry, you didn't see that. Here we have her. Very nice. I love how her eyes look like drowsy and somewhat droopy. Goodness. Uh, but these guys are so old that there aren't even fakes of them because nobody. Nobody wants them. I can show you a whole my figure collection page of people looking for them. There we go. And let's grab our other girly, my favorite girly. All right, so took that off. And she's also got two on her hair ties. Very nice. The hair ties seem very movable, so I'm definitely gonna have to be careful with those. I also like the colors of her kimono better. I think it just really matches her. And then we've got our other girly. There's a little bit of paint mishap on her. There's a little bit of pink on her leg. She doesn't have any yellow on her leg or anything. She definitely has some pink on her leg right there. But here's our other one. And they do go together. I'm gonna hold them in the correct spots. Pop, 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 pop. Supposed to be posed together like this, I wanna say. Cause they're sisters, they're twins, they're besties. Oh my gosh, I'm so happy with these. So I definitely thought these would be bigger than they are. Not disappointed in any by any means. Definitely happy I got them. <sighs> How do you go? Let me look at the picture. Is there a picture? There is a picture. Yeah. Okay. 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 How many more times can I say okay before I understand? Uh oh, okay. Now I understand. <laughs> okay, just like this. So I kind of had to twist them into place, but they do slide together. And let's get that base out. I've seen these girls displayed together. I've also seen them displayed like separately around like a something. I'm gonna display them together. And when I get the nendroids, I'm gonna display the nendroids around their big, big base. <laughs> these are 2006 by Clamp. That's the studio, apparently. I've never heard of Clamp before or after these guys, so I don't know. <laughs> I like I like how they look. I think they turned out really well, besides the little bit of pink on her leg. But figures from 2006, older than what I thought, I think they look really good. Here's the base. It's a nice, simple black with a gold little rim. The seam on the gold isn't bad. It's right there, and you can't even tell, which is awesome. And then... Let's do our little pizza pie transfer. They fit perfectly. So in the pro tip pictures, the reason I thought they were bigger is because I thought the base was bigger. But nope. I'm gonna hold their kimonos and show you. These are the girls. Oh my gosh. I love them. I really do. Oh my goodness. So cute. I can't wait to put them next to the girls. Can you see the pink on her leg, though? Yeah, right there. <sighs> I'll live with it. Because I'm not going to live without them. Beautiful. Oh, my gosh. They're so cute. Oh, I love how they're, like, holding each other's arms, and they're both, like, shh, to each other. So cute. Oh. But anyway, that's the video. Thank you for coming. Thank you for unboxing. Well, is this my first grill? Thank you for opening my first grill on this channel with me, and I will see you guys in the next video, which I'm probably going to be filming tomorrow because 
Kaching came out a month early and she'll be appointed her Liyue um, Electro Vision. And I also have two Hello Good Smile dolls and a few Nendroid customization things. So I'll get to show you guys my custom Nendroid that I had made or kind of put together. Excuse me, kind of put together. But anyways, one more time for the camera, for the girls. Give it up for the girls. Give it up for the front of the dress, not the back of the dress. That's what I'm getting right now. But one more time. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video.